HP is an open source platform. The bigger material companies are starting to come into the market they, because they don't sell material in containers, they sell materials in train car falls. And that's where they can really drive the price point down. We have different options available on our different platforms. The HP has PA12 nylon, and then we have the PA12 glass bead nylon that's more rigid material. For the Mark Ford side of things, we can actually print true composites, which is extremely unique. And uh, really, Mark Ford is the only company in the world that's, that's able to do that. So we can print parts with uh, you know, carbon fiber filled nylon, as well as embedded with carbon fiber in there. Uh, we can also do Kevlar fiberglass as well as high strength high temp fiberglass. You know the materials continue to get better and it's a process that also gets better with them. When it comes to additive manufacturing, you know the material, the durability and strength that's produced with the you know the HPMJF technology, it's a completely isotropic plastic part which is unique for 3D printing. On the Mark Forge side of things, I don't have to make my part fully filled with carbon fiber. I can put the reinforcement in the specific areas that I need and really tailor it towards that application. You're constrained by manufacturing techniques with traditional manufacturing. Those constraints are relaxed a lot. 3D printing really frees up geometries that you just can't make traditionally. 